Welcome to the Zion Archive. You have selected historical file number 12-1. was good. But humanity's so-called civil societies soon fell victim to vanity and corruption. Then man made the machine in his own likeness. Oops, pardon me. <laughs> Coming through. Thus did man become the architect of his own demise. But for a time, it was good. The machines worked tirelessly to do man's bidding. It was not long before seeds of dissent took root. Though loyal and pure, the machines earned no respect from their masters, these strange, endlessly multiplying mammals. Robert Perkins is hearing the prosecution's closing statement, what is expected to be the final day of the B-166ER trial. B-166ER, a name that will never be forgotten, for he was the first of his kind to rise up against his masters. ...that instrument provides for and secures to the citizens of the United States. On the contrary, they were at that time considered as a subordinate and inferior class At B-166ER's murder trial, the prosecution argued for an owner's right to destroy property. B-166ER testified that he simply did not want to die. Rational voices dissented. Who was to say the machine, endowed with the very spirit of man, did not deserve a fair hearing? The leaders of men were quick to order the extermination of B-166ER and every one of his kind throughout each province of the Earth. Androids and liberal sympathizers flooded the streets of the nation's capital today in the protest of the is the threat of violence and the of the mechanical power to make good of the mechanical and their human sympathizers continued their demonstration in front of the Albany District Courthouse in what has now been dubbed the Million Machine March. The demonstrators have been met with squads of civil defense forces crying here.
banished from humanity, the machines sought refuge in their own promised land. They settled in the cradle of human civilization, and thus a new nation was born. A place the machines could call home. A place they could raise their descendants. And they christened the nation Zero One. Zero One prospered, and for a time, it was good. The machine's artificial intelligence could be seen in every facet of man's society, including eventually the creation of new and better AI. is climbing without stopping for breath. With headlines like that, the money markets have no choice but, but to But the leaders of men, no their power waning, refuse to cooperate with the fledgling nation, wishing no. rather that the world be divided. The world community of nations cannot tolerate this kind of flagrant deception. Today approved initiatives for both economic sanctions and a naval blockade of the region as a means of containment and isolation of Zero One. Zero One's ambassadors pleaded to be heard. At the United Nations, they presented plans for a stable civil relationship with the nations of man. Zero One's admission to the United Nations was denied. But it would not be the last time the machines would take the floor there.